All right, we're here taking a look at the first 45 minutes of Midnight Club Los Angeles for the Xbox 360. I'm Chris. I'm Joe. Hey, good nice robot. Let's get on the road here. It's it's definitely Los Angeles. Yeah. This is not some stripped down, um, you know, crappy version. I mean, it looks phenomenal. Yeah, it, it doesn't really look good. like generic city with Hollywood in the background. It's this definitely looks and feels like LA. Yeah, almost a little too much. There's ads everywhere. Everywhere. So much ads. so that it's like it benefits the world because it makes it look real. Right. You know, it's like it always adds to the atmosphere, but. There's so many, and you're going by so fast that it, they almost become repetitive. Yeah. So you feel like you're passing the same Best Buy again. For me, it made the, the city feel a little smaller, a little more condensed. Yeah. But, but there are these little touches, like the screen we're looking at right now, that little Mexican grill. Absolutely an L.A. Yeah. Mexican place right there. And just the little touch is really not, it doesn't look like Vancouver with Hollywood in the background. Everyone said that Liberty City and GTA 4 was the first, like, truly alive city. Right. And for a city that you're just seeing out of, like, the window of your car going by 150 miles an hour, right. this one feels like they've pushed the bar even more. Great car models. Um, maybe not quite Gran Turismo level, but certainly better than GTA. And I'd, I'd put them on par with Forza. I really wish there was some better damage modeling. Uh, like we said, it was maybe a hundredth of what it should be in real life. Mm -hmm. And you wish it was a tenth of what it should be in real life. I think we both agree, it looks great. Yeah. How does it handle? It is definitely fun. It's not the most realistic racing I've ever felt. It's a little arcadey. Some some physics and weight issues where your car sometimes feels like it's kind of glued to the ground. It's overcompensating for the steering, but it won't. you don't really lose control. Like you tap a little bit to the left and you go all the way to the left, but right. you can recover very easily. We saw a brief story. You're the new guy in town, but really it gets, <laughs> cares, down to, yeah, it gets down to you're on the car, it's an open world environment, and it's nice. It feels like the old Need for Speed games in the, you know, the police chase sections, mm -hmm. in that they are totally ruthless, yeah. they do not care about any pedestrians, and they're also extremely skilled drivers. Hey, it's LA. Yeah, that's true. That's what they do. After 45 minutes, do you want to keep playing? Definitely. Definitely? I want to get a racing wheel and keep playing. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to keep playing too.